In the RKE experiment, you will use conservation of energy to measure the moment of inertia of this uh, wheel. It's called a rotodyne wheel, and then on it we have some uh, masses. So um, I put three of them on. Here's the fourth one. Make sure that you don't tighten it too much so you don't uh, strip the screw. And the distance from uh, the mass to the center is the K value that you need to measure, the, the K radius. Um, some other things that are here are the um, pulley, the encoded pulley, and um, make sure that the pulley is roughly tangential to the wheel so that when the string comes around, it comes tangentially down off the wheel. Also try to minimize the wobble of the wheel. Uh, make sure that the surface is um, as horizontal as you can get it um, so that you don't add any extra unnecessary uh, error in your calculations. So I'm going to wind the string and then hang it over the pulley. And the first thing you're asked to do is to add a few paper clips uh, to compensate for friction. So here I'm going to add the paper clips and hold on to the wheel. It's easier done with several people. Um, so now I'm going to let go of this and using Logger Pro to measure um, the speed of the wheel, I want to see a horizontal line for the, for the speed. I want the speed to be constant. And in that case, uh, the weight of the paper clips is going to compensate for uh, the friction force that is in the system. So here I'm going to give it a, just a little bit of a push. And you'll notice that the wheel is rotating uh, very slowly at a constant rate. And in the Logger Pro um, image, you'll see that uh, the velocity is indeed staying constant. Now, before the paper clips hit the ground, uh, stop Logger Pro because you don't want to add um, any of that jerk to the end of your data. All right, so after you do this measurement and are convinced that the speed is constant so that you have enough paper clips um, added to um, to the um, string, you are asked to add 60 grams to the string. So 60 grams is the mass weight plus 10 grams. Let me see, I mean, I'm in the mass hanger, sorry. So hang the mass hanger here. And then make sure that it doesn't wobble as it's falling down, but then get ready to record uh, data with Logger Pro. Let this go, record the velocity, and then stop the wheel, stop the recording before the mass hanger hits the ground. So you will take measurements with um, the loads and without the loads. Please be careful when you take the loads off, don't drop them on the table, they will nick the tabletops. Um, so um, be gentle with the equipment. Again, uh, try to make sure that the pulley is as tangential to the wheel as you can. Uh, make sure that the wheel is um, flat, it's horizontal. Uh, make sure that there is no wobble in the system. If there is, note that in your notebook and in your lab report, you can um, comment on that. For this lab, you have to write a full lab report uh, that includes the abstract that you've done for the previous lab, um, introduction and theory, the procedure, analysis, error analysis, results and conclusions.